Hello everybody, I'm here again with some new things. So I want to share with you this new brush holder. If I can get it to be fairly straight, which I think is a much better way for me to store my brushes. Um, get my finger out of the way. Let's see if I can go in so as you can look over the top there and you will see that the holes are different sizes so if I take that one out you can see there's a big hole at the front and then a slightly where are we slightly smaller hole and then we an even bigger uh, smaller hole so uh, three different sizes and I'll just put those back goodness knows where my camera will be going um but i think that that is a really good solution for my brushes so i am still got some things to share so the next thing that i want to share with you is this tub and it has this sponge in it which I think, let me just get some water out of this spray water bottle. So if we wet the sponge, we can then use that, screw that back on again, uh, to clean our brush instead of using lots of different pieces of tissue and and cloth so um let's see what have i got handy here we go so if i bring this in we can use our water to wet our brush but i'm just gonna put the brush there so let's say we've we've used let's find a little bit of nondescript paper that we don't mind using here we go let's use this little pad so let's say we've we've painted something and then if we rinse our brush instead of wiping it on a tissue we can just wipe it on this damp sponge and I think that is much better and much more tidy and I can just wash that sponge out and reuse it and reuse it. So I think that was a really good purchase. The brush holder came from eBay and I will try and find the link for you. Um, this little sponge came from team you and see look it hasn't where are we it, the bottom is still quite dry even though the top is is quite wet so it's really going to work well for once you've rinsed your brush in your water to just tap it into onto the sponge so um i think that is a really good little purchase uh what else was i going to show you yes so, oh, actually, I think I will leave those out because we want to test. So let's just take that out a minute. So uh, the next thing I want to show you is just a bit of fun. Um, well, I thought it was a little bit of fun anyway. Uh, let's see if we can find, uh, there's the opening. So this is a key ring, but it's a key ring of the colour wheel. And it's, it actually, actually spins around, which I thought was fantastic. It was like a pound. Um, but I, th I think that that's a, a lovely idea. And it actually has um, triadic colours um, in the middle there. And then you've got complementary colours on this outside. Um 
so that complementary colours would be the blue and the orange and then you've got amalgus colours so they're the ones that are next to each other on the colour wheel when we pick um, some colours that are all going to work together like those four colours there. So um, I just think that that's a bit of fun and saves taking um, a colour wheel with you wherever you go because you can just use this. Isn't it cute? I'll bring it up a bit closer so that you can you can see. So that's just a, a little bit of fun that I bought. And then I got these. These were £10 something. And these are travel brushes. Um, quite how good they will be for £10 something. I don't know. But let us have a try. I will get my piece of paper again. And do we get three? Yes, we get we get three in this pouch. So this is the biggest one. Let's see how we get in there. Oh, there we go. Do they uns oh they unscrew? Oh wow. Do they fit on the end? They screw onto the end. Ah, oh, I mean, it says foom, foom, foomy, foomy. Where are we? Which way do I need to go? There. This is a size 12. It reminds me of an Escoda. Now, obviously, these have got um, kind of like a coating on them to keep them in shape while they're um traveling so i just need to wipe that off in my water bottle but let's just well actually let's keep my sponge out why don't i and get all of that in there we go so that I can't believe I got that for £10. Whoa! So let's just rinse it. And then dry it off a bit on the, on the sponge. I mean, if you can see, it's really got quite a nice point on it. I think that that's rather lovely. And I like the fact that the lid screws on either way. Some of them just push in and after a while they get very loose. So that is our size 12, which I will put in there. The next one is a size 8. So there we go, there's, there's our size 8. Colour down, dry it off, and that has also got a really nice point on it. I'm impressed. I'm very impressed with the price, and also that they've got this little hole in the bottom so it's breathable. So a 12, an 8, and let's see what our final one is, a size 4. There we go, size 4, which way around that way. Yeah, that's looking good. Well, there's nothing wrong with those. I'm pleasantly 
I didn't get all that off, did I? That's the Viridian. That's got a phalo in it, I would imagine. There we go. Clean it off. So, 12, 8 and 4. Perfect little combination. All in this. Obviously, it's not leather. It's just pretend leather. There. Impressed. £10 something. Wow. Mm. So that's um, those that I wanted to share with you. Let me just pop this back in. Like so. And so the other thing that I wanted to show you was this which is called a bottle pen and you can see it's got this little cap and this kind of nib on it and I have found that it is perfect for filling up water brushes because where am I You just squeeze. There we go. And fill your water brush up. So if you're taking water brushes out with you, that works perfectly. Just testing to see if there's anything coming out. And no, so it didn't use very much of the um, water. It's uh, actually, how can I do this? It's probably used about that much. And so there's still four fifths available. So I could fill my water brush up four more times out of this if I wanted to, this bottle pen. And I think that is a great solution for just something very slim that you can carry with you to fill your water brushes up with. So, a few purchases that I think were bargains. Um, there we go, let's do it like that move them out of the way so which I wanted to share I've got a few more things on order more storage on order I've also got some Holbein tubes coming watercolor tubes of paint for those of you that don't know Jackson's has got a sale with their watercolors although it does exclude Daniel Smith the only colour that I have that is Holbein is their Bright Rose. I don't have any other tubes that are Holbein. And I don't have any half pans or full pans either. So Holbein is a brand that I haven't really tried. So whilst um, the sale is on, I thought that that would be um, an opportunity. So I've ordered eight five mil tubes because obviously I'm not sure if I'm going to like them or not um, and I think it came to about 30 pounds something like that um, for eight five mil tubes which I don't think is too bad to just have a bit of a, um, a play around and a practice with so quickie there for you today sharing my new paintbrush holder sponge travel um, travel watercolor brushes this nifty little <laughs> key ring and this bottle pen for refilling your water brushes so hopefully i will be able to get round and do um, our next animal watercolor postcard over the weekend i'm not sure if any of my purchases um, will arrive um, until next week 
but in any case it's Friday and it's almost the weekend so um, I hope you all uh, have a wonderful weekend if I don't pop in and see you um, until next week. All right, take care everybody. Please subscribe, it's for free. Hit the notice bell. You don't have to um, do it for all videos, you can choose. And um, for those of you that want to join and do the membership, it's 99p a month. And it does mean that you get to see the videos before everyone else. As a member, you get that privilege to see them beforehand. And, um, you know, I've uploaded a PDF. There, there are some other little nifty things that you might um, be able to get. I'm thinking more on that as time goes on. So there we go. Take care. See you again next time.